remember on the 22nd of June, when I pulled that slip. We planted the root section here. I planted the top here. And I planted the other part that I broke off over here. This, this was a slip that had the original roots. You see that they're, they're growing and extending. It's only been five to six weeks since I planted it. Uh, you'll notice here's where we broke off the other stem that I split in half. And if you look at the old video, you can you can see the growth of the vine. This was the, the top that was just simply cut off, stuck in the ground, and buried. So you can, you can see that it's, it's putting out roots, giving a longer time in the ground. These roots would, would uh, definitely later on develop a sweet potato. Uh, but at this point, the main purpose of this video was to show you that all you need to do is cut your slip, get it planted in the ground, and keep it watered for a few days, and uh, it will take root. And that was the top of that one slip. Here's the bottom. Here's the top. All right, this is the bottom portion that was cut away from, from this one right here. You, you can see it, it's, it sprouted roots. And if I can get this position just right, right here where my finger is, is where it was clipped from the top of the plant which came from there so you can see that, that they both are forming roots because it's a, a purple sweet potato these would eventually grow into the actual sweet potato they would given a long enough season, they would actually grow big enough, swell out, and, and form a sweet potato off these big uh, purple roots. Some of these others are just feeder roots for nutrients. Um, you can see on this one as well, it, it's got potentially good roots. So, there's our cutting from the 22nd of June.